Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q4 of the weekly contest 277, Maximum Good People Based on Statements. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Um, yeah, let me know what you think about this problem. This is possibly the only more interesting problem in this contest set. But even then, I think this was a little bit on the easier side. I honestly second guessed myself when I was solving this problem because I thought that this may have a tricky solution. But no, it's just about consistency. The key thing to note, um, and this is something that you probably want to get used to when you do competitive programming, doesn't come up as much on interviews, but definitely do that, uh, is recognizing that this is um, possibly MP complete. Um, I, I did had when I first read this, I did think that maybe it is a two set problem type thing where I have to do two set, right? Um, and if you don't know what that is, take a good Google, but it doesn't really apply here. So, but I, that's what I was maybe gearing up my mind to. Um, but then when I saw N is equal to 15, I was like, oh, it's just, um, you know, it's just brute force, right? Because N is equal to 15, then that means that you could brute force each person being a good person and not a good person, and then just figure it out from there. Uh, yeah. And that's pretty much all I did. I, I brute force whether a person is a good person or not a good person for all two to the 15. And then for each one, I do do an N square check to make it to see if it's consistent. Um, and the consistency here is that, okay, um, basically here I brute force on the I person being a good person or not. And I pasted this because I always forget. But yeah, I, I brute force on whether the I person is good or not. And if the I person is good, then the statements that the I person says to be good. So we check what the I person made about J. And if 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 they say the the um, if they say person J is is bad, but they're good, then this is not consistent. If if I say J is bad but is good or the other way around if it if, if, if they said they're good but they're bad then also not consistent otherwise it's consistent we just return true we this is going to be n square of course and uh, but and this is two to the n so in total this is o of n square times two to the n which for 15 is apparently fast enough in terms of uh space this is just uh is this even n square no i think this is just o of n right O of n space, um, which is actually better than linear because the size of the input is linear. Um, and also in that sense, this is linear times two to the n. But anyway, yeah, I don't really, I mean, I don't know if there's a cooler way of doing it. Like I said, I was thinking about two sad for a bit, but this is something that everyone should do. And I actually was a little bit bad about this. I didn't notice the n as you go to 15 until a little bit later. And even then I was like, is n squared times 2 to the n fast enough? Wasn't sure. Uh, it turns out that it was, but I just wasn't sure. Um, cool. That's really all I have for this one, to be honest. Uh, yeah, I mean, just a consistency check on brute forcing. So, yeah. And a lot of people got in it. So let me know. I actually did forget. when I, I did get a wrong answer on this one because I did forget to submit this uh, with this statement because I thought... I wasn't sure about this, to be honest, during the contest, because I was like, okay, if they say it's bad, or if they say it's good, but they may just be wrong, right? But I don't know. That was a real logic. So got a what, five minute wrong answer from that. Anyway, that's all I have for this one. Uh, you can watch me solve it live in the contest. Next. Yes, I'm messing with this poem. <sighs> <clears throat> What a silly pro contest to have a five minute penalty. Yikes. Still tilted about problem one. Beat the problem, Larry. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> and it's 15 so this is some sort of brute force I guess um, let's actually read what this problem means I think J is oh but I just put it here
two to the fifteen n squared. Is that good enough? Hmm. This really seems like this is going to decide a contest. Everything else doesn't really matter. <laughs> There's a logical problem. <sighs> Where's my mic anyway? Hmm. Less than 10 minutes still, I guess. Um, hmm. I don't know if this is necessary actually, but. How do I figure out this? Okay, yeah. Then every statement that set if
Is this good enough? I don't even know, to be honest. Might be too slow. That's not true. It should be fast enough. It might not be right, but it should be fast enough. Oh, whoops. Where am I? Wow, people finished. A lot of people finished, even. Wow. <coughs> I don't know if this is true, but I'm going to give it a submit and see if that's good. It's a lot of people finished. Wow, seven minutes. Yikes. On my end. Okay, and I don't know how to do this, so... I get two, but expected is one. Why is this one? Hmm. Is this a known problem? How do people write it so quickly? Well done, friends. I don't know how to do this, though, no, but... So this thinks that this is a routed configuration. And I don't really... Oh, they don't know anything about each other, though. Okay. Do you think that this is good? Why? One and three is good. Three thinks one is bad. Do I need to transitive kosher this? Because if this thing that this person is good. Why is this true? <coughs> This is true. If this one is good, then it thinks that this one is good, but I have it as false. Did I mess up? No, it thinks that. Okay, so if it thinks that. So this thinks that this is a good person and this thinks that this is a bad person. Okay. Hmm. So how did I miss that? Maybe that's a silly mistake thing. Uh, today's a lot of silly mistakes. I don't know if this is right, but it's more right, at least. Th that's actually a silly one to miss. That's actually a silly one to miss. Yeah, let me know what you think about this contest, this video, or this problem, whatever you need. Uh, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. But more importantly, stay good, stay healthy to good mental health. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.